Tara here from Made for Mums, and we've got a really special guest today, Mylene Class. Thank you so much for being with us. Well, you've had a busy day. It's been mental. <laughs> it's been <laughs> it's been mental. Been mental. Day. Stories about door knockers and all sorts, but we won't we sing won't Christmas <laughs> jumpers. Oh, have school. you? Well, the two, my two little girls, but yeah, they woke up this morning and they're just like, oh, we need to make Christmas jumpers. So oh, like, that happens, doesn't it? Okay, it's like five to eight. Absolutely. Why did you do that? There you go. I was doing Christmas angel things this morning yeah. as well. Yeah. Did you sort them? Absolutely. Nothing has ever thrown me into as big a tailspin as I need him an Anne Boleyn costume by tomorrow. Anne so. Boleyn. <laughs> I thought you meant I, like angel things. No, no, no. After, uh, since it's Anne Boleyn, I think everything after that is like, <laughs> I, I gauge everything on, is it Anne Boleyn level? Oh, God, so it's easy. It was a breeze. Yeah, no, that was fine. Christmas jump was fine. easy. No, no, no Henry VIII stuff going on. No, we haven't had that yet. <laughs> <laughs> I think even I could come up with that costume before Anne Boleyn. But oh anyway, God. we digress. That was my one. That was yours. <laughs> Um, so we're looking at Miley's amazing new range for spring yes. next year. Um, let's have a look. Oh, let me this show you. is yeah. Oh, Should we start? Which end do you want to start? Um, is this the, is this little baby range? Yes. It's so nice. this yeah. end. Um, oh look at that. My K subsequently before baby K, which then grew up, grew and uh, so my K has always been known for having a nice full tutu. And what I think is so nice about these as well so is that. Cute. They're really fantastic quality. They're really full. That is so nice. So they sit really nicely. Oh, do they? Can I stretch into them? Maybe not that one. <laughs> I tried. Have a good one. Have a good one. You could. Go into that one. one. One leg. So it's oh, so adorable. So, and when oh, it's that's teamed. So, and that's really SJP to me. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There was an episode where she had a sort of yeah, big dress and just a t-shirt. Yeah, and that, I was like, that is adorable. Again, for, for me, I think these are just so easy to wear. And I love a statement tee. I make sure all of our statement or logo tees are really positive. Just really yes. empowering. I don't want yeah. them to feel princessy. And you get um, so many dodgy ones as well. Yeah, you know, we're always covering stories. Of no, look, like up. the last, uh, the last items had genius and oh, yeah. superhuman, oh. awesome. And I just think you know the bees knees. It's just adorable. So little cute. bees on there. Oh, it's so cute. So, oh, and it is. It's soft and it's practical. Nothing yeah, you know, the washes again. We're really, really um, specific oh, about. So, this is this really is lovely. So I'm, I'm obsessed with grey mall. So this is so nice grey mall. Lovely. Yeah, and because it's unisex as well, so that is gorgeous. I just think yeah. what's going to look really cute on, yeah. on Instagram. And actually, they're really Instagram uh, friendly pieces. But you know, quite practical greys. It was always white when when my little girl was one. Well, this is much better. This was a monochrome collection, it's so, so we, nice. we've pulled out. Obviously, there's black and white where we've pulled out the elements of grey, which tie all together. Yeah. And on this occasion, what we have got is just splashes, like flecks of colour yeah. as well, just to just to give it a, a little bit of a move on. Look at these ones. Oh. And they're gender neutral as well, yeah, which of is what I like. Yeah. Oh, so cute. Which especially so helps. Oh, it's actually making me want a baby, and I definitely don't want another baby. You're getting very tempted. I'm tempted. Oh, oh I had to show. I love the shape of these. Oh, oh, they're underneath. Look, there they are. I thought these were just adorable. Oh, so, so again, cute. these are just. Oh my god! Look at the little no. Oh, they're so. Very cute. easy to wear, and and I think I what's nice style. is just the amount of detail that's in there. Yeah. So super simple, super comfy. Yeah. I know my own girls; they just want to throw on their outfits and and, and just go. And the nice, the, the beauty with this is, whatever you throw on, is still gonna just all gonna go. Gonna go. Yeah. So I do not everything I have is patterned, and none of it goes, and in a way, it all goes. It's all goes. Yeah. It's fabulous. <laughs> Look, even me standing next to you. <laughs> It goes. Lucky. It just goes. Pat it just shot. Fabulous and chintzy. Here we go. <laughs> uh, these we shot oh, yesterday. So I had I had four little babies in these. Oh, oh and they're so cute. Again, they're just so simple and they just stand out a mile. Really so cute. this is great. Send them over to Grandma's oh, in these. Oh, these are so good. And again, like you said, gender, gender neutral. Yeah. So there's really some really nice. really lovely pieces. Uh, clever is the new cool. Love that. So my Love girls, that. I mean, my girls play a huge part in the inspiration oh, yeah. of, of the range. They always say, you know, what would you like to see? What would you like to wear? They always love the items that have awesome uh, or, or, or anything that's so they like cool, to say something. something. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah. At the moment, they're wearing um, the um, the sequin bunny ears that you can flip, and oh. and so. I, th I just think again, I get that inspiration from them to know what it is they like yeah. rather than thinking this is what you would like. Yeah, yeah. Queen bees! So cute. Do you know what? I just love the shape, the drain. Yeah. Like if you could, if I could get that in a bigger size, you have a venture <laughs> to do that. No problem. It's I'm a sure. nice frame up the A line, isn't it? 
Well, I think as well when we're cutting and when so we're then doing our grading, really we, we make sure it's going to hit at the exact right spot. Yeah. Because like little babies with their little knees, yeah. just you want to see it all. There's a little thought into the shape of that. Which uh, I there's really a like. huge yeah. amount of thought yeah. into the grazing and, yeah. and the fits. Huge yeah. amount. Just look at that. And that is even just even where the neckline hits. So yeah, everything. You know, I've, I've been with, with Mother Care so now for nice. 10 years, so... <gasps> Nearly over ten years. Oh, so one of my first things I bought for my ba my little girl who's five now was um, you did a Moses basket, and it was yes. um, grey with orange spots and right. turquoise, That's right. and it was the first item I bought for Mother Care. And See, I and that was ten years ago. Still got it. Ten years. And also, it just shows that at the time when I started with Mother Care, we started with a monochrome collection, and at the yeah. time it was just whoa, black on babies, yeah. black and white. Uh, now people I think are more accustomed to it and it's great because it's almost it's the right time for my case to come back with the monochrome yeah. collection. Yeah, because you but sort of the last couple of years ago it was quite bright and you were doing quite yeah. more red prints and stuff. So yeah. when I first saw this I was like, Oh, she's gone back to something a little bit different. We just took it back to where we first yeah. started because yeah. it was nice to just almost revisit it. Yeah. So and it, and it's just been a massive success. So yeah. oh these and these are just look at that, cool, comfy. These I want in my son. I was going to say, <laughs> I mean, I'm kind of wearing something similar to it, but the, again, those and so the zips and the little back pocket with the zip. Well, they this can is hide it. all sorts of sweets and old chocolate. Stones. Oh, yeah, stones. <laughs> the stones at the moment are ruining my, my so washing machine. Collecting. Oh no! They keep putting stones in lip gloss. I'm like, somebody oh, help me. Oh, they're so cheeky. Yeah, my daughter's obsessed with stones. Stones and lip gloss. I don't know. Uh, talking about the inflection of colour. So again, Lovely. we've got the monochrome, but it's just that's so that cool. I love that as well. Yeah, cute. Ooh. Oh, yes! Yes, yes baby! Yes. <laughs> yes. This is all grown up stuff. It's like my husband would love that. Have actually. a feel of the inside, though. Oh, yeah. I love this. And it's. Oh, and like they can put that one even because it's the best one or nothing yeah. on underneath. And it's just cozy. I wanted it house. to be super cozy. Yeah. I mean, and the, I know we're talking about the spring summer collection and we're out in the middle of winter, but you can guess. It all. Yeah. And there's still crossover pieces that will then be able to carry you through the season. Absolutely. This is a really great unisex tee. So that yesterday so cool. I put this on a boy model and a girl model. We were shooting yesterday and neither of them wanted to take it off, which is a great sign, except <laughs> the clock was ticking and, and, and the parents wanted to get them out. But I thought that's great and it's leopard print and it's, it's you know, it's really hugely progressive. Yeah. It's great. And do you know what else I mean? It's these little, it's this little fold there. Yes. Just a little thing. Yes. It's just a little fold on the t-shirt that makes it look cool. And again, just choosing the right kind of grey mar and choosing the right kind of leopard. So, so I thought an, an oversized print was going to be more yeah. appropriate. And like my husband would love that. He's definitely not going to get to see it then either. But <laughs> I love that. I love that as well. I'm I like that you're going to do this and shopping for your <laughs> I'm thinking, when are you going to do the grey oh, mar? Wait, 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 oh, wait, wait. wait. Oh, that's so cute! This oh, that's is so cute! Sitting on that is adorable. Drawer. You that see, I thought so they were more cool. like rabbits, but Hero, my youngest, has decided they're mice. So. Yeah, they've not quite got the big ears for rabbits. I think she's right. That was her point. Yeah, so. she's absolutely But spot I just on. thought, again, <laughs> on, the, on the face of it, you see like a, you know, a standard grey tee, and then it's all the about the details, details the surprise like that. I really I love, like that. I love the surprises that you see That's with it. So, so we've definitely got the alarm through there. So cute. Look, look, look at the ears to stand up. So it's cute. I love the little conversation pieces as well. And again, yeah, they go with everything that we have. So nice, you can pick and choose your yeah, range. Absolutely. This is a personal favourite, of course. Oh I'm a sucker for leopard print. Oh, that's so nice as well. What can I show you? Oh, wow. And bunnies are featuring massively at the it's moment. Quite big. Um, yeah, they I are. think it's lots to do with my own children that are just obsessed with cats, bunnies, dolphins, oh, unicorns. Well, they just adore oh, unicorns, is the other one, isn't it? Yeah. So, oh, this so is seem, this seems like a really so nice cute. piece. Oh, so, and you can, oh, I love that pink as well. Uh, this family sort of we wanted. I wanted a really vintage blush yes, kind yeah, of antique pink that would just again not make it overly girly, but at the yeah. same time it could be if you wanted to go that. It's direction. not princessy pink. Is no, it's a little bit. It's a bit cooler than yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. And then again, I mean, I'm, I'm saying that it's boys and girls, but I think that's that could I just show it's it's, isn't it. It's gender neutral. Totally. Yeah, I love that. Oh, this is this is this is hero all over. Oh, oh that's dress, so, so cute. I will make you a so this is like inspired completely. Yeah. Oh, All my so lessons are inspired by my girls because I mean, 
obviously they're, I mean, I'm, but they're, they're like my little muses. Yeah. They show me what they like every single day. And, yeah. And and also, any mum will tell you that they'll, they'll be the first to say, oh, I don't like the low ball here, or this is itchy, this is or label. I don't it's like... So all of the yeah. labels, well, there are no labels. Everything's a back neck print. Yeah, it's, so it's a little thing. Eradicate that problem. That's, that is number one. And the other one is... Um, Sleeves that are a slightly funny length, that yeah. they're a bit short so they can't pull them down. No, no, no. when we do the fit meetings, we're all very specific with the rest of the team, in my case team, and we know exactly where we want it to be because, you know, as a team of mums, it's such, like, my husband buys the odd thing every now and then and it's, it'll be a cute dress but the buttons will be tiny so you can't do them up because they're yeah. not going to stand there for three hours, the sleeves are wrong, or you know? And I think something that's forgotten a, a lot as well is that with mother care, the, the health and safety testing that goes into this is second to none, which doesn't often happen on the high street because it's not necessarily, it, it, it's not always expected. It's yeah. not. And well, I was really surprised at that. You know, we're not even allowed to have, um, we, we've got a, a degree of as to how much shrinkage you were allowed. Now, if, if it even begins to shrink, and I can shrink anything, I'm, yeah. I should actually be the tester for it. <laughs> but it, you, you just look at, you know, there, there might be certain fabrics, fabrication, certain laces, or certain embroidery on clay, for example. We wouldn't use them. We wouldn't be allowed to, because a little, little one could get their finger trapped. Uh-huh. But you then yeah. see it everywhere else, and you just think, I'm so glad that I do work with an amazing team and with Mothercare who put those safety requirements in place. Because... Yeah. You, you already know that we're thinking of those bits. Yeah. We'll, we'll look at the cosy toes. So if any of our baby grows, for example, <laughs> if they've got any little pieces of thread yes. that could potentially get caught around toes, you know, your baby can't tell you. Yeah, yeah we, we had a dad. We, we make sure that, that that doesn't happen. Yeah, we had a dad who had what they called it a toe tourniquet. It was exactly that. Right. And they, they were screaming and screaming and they realised, and it was a delicate operation. So yeah. little things like that. Well, so mother care are thinking yeah. of those things already. And so to think that... You know, I work with a, a company that ensures that those things are already looked at before anything else, before the design process even kicks off. Yeah. It's, it's really reassuring. Ooh, as, as, a mom, as, as, as a mom. As a mom. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to grab these bits here. I don't know if I've got it out of shop. I want that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want this just to make makeup. So, I know, I couldn't fit all my makeup in there. I had about five of those. <laughs> <laughs> that is so But accessories cute. have been really big for, for my Kay and... I think it's about, again, still keeping it age appropriate, but super fun. So yeah. this little bag is just... And is that, has that got a long strap? How can we, how can we mark that? Oh strap. yeah, brilliant. It's long, so it just goes round. Absolutely. Goes bits and bobs, they're stones. It's patent, it's <laughs> work clean. So <laughs> that's it, isn't it? It's all those little... I'm going out of your shop, out of your shop to grab the high tops. It's a great... Oh my God. <laughs> so these are, again. Oh, going to fall so cute. And you need to get into it. It's got a zip. Oh, that's got a zip. See, 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 see these little things Mums. on me. Mum. So, yeah. We don't have time and the laces are coming undone. Oh, no, listen, I, the, the drama of laces in the morning. Do kids like, are, do your girls, can they do their laces? One can, yeah. and one will do a million knots. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I just don't buy lace shoes. Which so means I have to sit there. and undo the knot oh, at night. So, have you taught them though? Have you yeah. done it, have you? The rabbit goes round, it just it. free, oh, and it goes through that. the hole. Can you come over? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> that is perfect though, that's it. And those with those, and so it looks cool with the lacy. Yeah, I think a high top that. with like, for it's example, so like the two cute. shoes. I love that. That is so SJP with it. I love it. I like where you're going with your so, style. And look, we've got this as well. Awesome. What have you grabbed? Oh yeah, the snapbacks. Awesome. So the snapback caps with awesome written on it. I mean, it's not and really more fit rabbits. Much, but well, these are great. So I think what's so nice so about this is cute. Oh, and yeah. the zip as well. So yeah. Little surprise at the back. Yeah. And little ones can just you know have two little rabbits in their pocket. I mean, so who doesn't want a little rabbit living in their pocket? Oh. Do you know what? I'm so impressed with this collection. Like, it's all those little things that I'm gonna. The little things that our mums know, and you know it's like the Velcro, and it's the loops getting caught, and it's the neck, and it's the labels, and it's yeah. all been thought of. It's really Also, you know, cool. even where this cuts, you don't want it to be too low, you don't want them fidgeting with it, yeah. you don't want them to have a zip that's going to be a reliable zip that's also, again, we've backed it, there's nothing's going to get caught in there, yeah. vests or skin. When you don't look like that quickly, or they're running No, 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 off. everything yeah. is... I'm looking at this as a consumer, I'm looking at this as a mother, I'm looking at can I shrink it, can I, is it going to go a funny colour in the wash, it, it, all of those things from a practical point of view right through to the design element as to is it striking, is that mum getting value for money, yeah. uh, is there enough choice 
uh, if you've got a boy, if you've got a girl, often you hear it all the time, and you know it's great for the girls, but there's, there's not as much out there for the boys. Yeah. So I've made yeah. sure that I'm catering for boys. I've got two beautiful godsons, the exact same ages as my own children, ah, and so, so you've got their input as well. Oh, it's like I hold kitchen focus groups. <laughs> And nobody, nobody feels bad about telling me the absolute truth, which is great. Good. So they they hold hold that nobody holds back, <laughs> which works really well. And um, Marlene, you mentioned um, pro the price then, the budget. So can you yeah. sort of vague sort of what they're like ranging some for? Of the like, tea, like, like, some of the tea, some of these are like starting mm. at like eight, eight pounds. Yeah. yeah, yeah, which is perfect. Yeah. Um, so again, I had to really look at what was going on market-wise, and and you know these are because there's a lot of competition out there. There is a lot of competition, yeah. and. At the same time, you want the mum to feel that she's getting value for money, and absolutely, I think the way that we've looked at our pricing, obviously we have to be able to afford to make the garments and get them sent over and, and do the job that they need to do. But at the same time, we want the mum to walk away feeling right. I've got value for money for this item. You know, yeah. some of our our, our socks, etc. You know, they start about three or four pounds. Yeah. So, yeah. It's, it's a competitive it's market, but at the same time, I feel that we've put ourselves in a position where it's it's a friendly price. Yeah, yeah, no, it's, and it's so nice, I love it. Um, right, I'm gonna see, sorry, I've got my director saying, have we got any comments? I don't know the passcode. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> it's live TV, guys, this is what happens. Christmas! <laughs> I don't know what my passcode. No, I don't know whose laptop that is, to be frank, let alone what the passcode is, I can have a guess. Try one, two, three, four. Maybe. Has it got in? It's got in? Yeah. Oh, what did you do for Christmas, Kylie? Christmas? Uh, have you bought, have you done all your shopping? Oh, God, no. Haven't you? I've wrapped no. everything. I hit all my really? Yeah, I've done everything. Wrapped, it's all hidden. You're the kind of person that gives me anxiety. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, because I was probably the person, someone else did that to me, so, like, so in a few years. That's not me at all. all. I'm, I'm a 23rd of Why are you? Kind of girl. But you've got to do it, so why don't you just get on and do it? I do it as, <laughs> as I'm seeing the people I'm seeing. Oh, okay. Yeah. But what about the girls? Because it's a. Oh, the girls are done. done. Oh, that's done. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, that's what I'm talking about. Family, oh, no, right. family. I'm not talking about. Oh, no, I think you've done all your shopping. I really mean, no, really mean the girls. I've done girls. There's things that are not. And Santa is sorted. Santa. Well, yeah, Santa, because it's not you, it's Santa. Oh, Santa is going to be doing it. Yeah, let's see what we. Oh, that, these guys, they are loving all the rabbit things. They're loving Yay! the tick too. We love the tick. Love about how much is the bag? We've got a question on oh, the bag. Oh, I've got a question on the bag yet. Is that £10? Pounds? £10? Pounds? Yeah, £10. Brilliant. My daughter Alice loves bunnies, cats. My son loves foxes. Foxes. Any foxes? That's the new woodland. Okay. Can you venture into they foxes? Have, this is noted. Noted by the This Ryan. is the kind of feedback I love. I, I love going on Twitter and going on Instagram and having a look at what other mums are saying. Yeah, saying. look, Stacey here, it's brilliant. There's no labels in clothes. My yeah. kids hate them, and that is the first thing with OG. It's like. Um, look, we, there are labels as to how to wash it, but they're in, in yeah, the places not that the are not the going back. to bother any little ones. So, you know, with my own girls. There's a label there, so obviously you know the size that you're looking at and how to wash it, yeah, etc. But don't you? it's certainly not going to be in the back neck. You, I, I challenge you to try and find one in the back neck. There won't be one. That's brilliant. That is so good. Um, Rebecca here says, I just love the black and white clothes, and it's so easy to add a pop of colour. The pop of colour, I yeah. think, just gives it um, a different look from obviously last season, which was yeah. just pure black and white. But I haven't gone too far from it, so um, the majority of it is. I think 99 percent of it, but again, like the little thing of colour just makes it just stand out even more. So, so gorgeous. Again, we've got had a baby cave for my son and daughter when they're babies. I love the range now. It's so soft. You no love it. Thank you. And one of this, it, all that range is perfect for all seasons. So, because I was thinking, is what? Oh, when's it going to be available? Is it this will be in January. In January. So just because yeah. I was thinking, yeah. for me, this is like um. Christmas Eve, you know you always get them in your outfit. Well, I always get so. I mean, fire, we've got Christmas Eve covered with the sparkles you've got your, and everything. You've got your sparkles it's stuff. all in yeah. there right now. But yes. there are things that we're calling flow throughs because this has been just so successful. This is in now, so, so and it'll just flow away through. Yeah. The high tops are in right now. Oh um, some of the tees are in right now. Uh, oh. Certainly the zip ups. Oh, and then okay. this will hit uh, in about, I think, the third week of January, third week of, third week of January. So there you go. Well, so they'll be, be able to sort of refresh the wardrobe. But yeah. the great thing is it's all going to still go with what you have, the existing pieces that you have. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, it's like kids having capsule wardrobes these days, yeah. isn't it? It's brilliant. Um, nice clothes and neutral for kids. Yes. I think some adults would like this, and this is it. We want to know when the adult range is coming out because we want all of this. I grow that. <laughs> you can squeeze well, yourself in. Well, the great thing is, in. again, when I started with Mother Care 10 years ago, it was it was not to three. That's because yeah. I was pregnant and all I could think about was baby, 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 baby. So well, it's not completely right. altruistic. My baby started growing and I was like, yeah, then it grew to three, then it grew to five, and then it, now it's at eight. It's where, but it's where you're at, isn't it? It's yeah. what you know completely. Yeah. You know what an eight year old girl is into and isn't into. So. Well, but then at the same time, you don't also say every eight year old girl is into that. Yeah. You know, as you said, some like foxes, some like bunnies, some like space. I mean, actually, the. Um, Got space space space. Oh, you have! I oh, love see space. these. We didn't see these. Look at these. Yeah, so cute. These are just really great. Oh. And I remember in the meeting, so one of the because I'm a bit space crazy. Are you? Like, have you ever been? Don't have been to space. Yeah. Not Would you pay? Today. Would you like to? <laughs> I don't know. So I mean, you like, actually go up. Like, my mum list of things that I need to do. I don't know how much time it would take out, but I'm obsessed it? with all things space. Mm. And I remember one of the constellations wasn't correct, so we removed it. And it's just like little things like that, you know. Correct. Oh, like the stars. There was an like extra big star bear. in Cassiopeia, so I was like, "Can we please remove that?" <laughs> but you know, <laughs> you no, know, you're gonna have some five-year-old <laughs> genius that's gonna be <laughs> like, <laughs> Ahem. "There was an extra star." Wow, yeah. that is brilliant. Well, it's not now. It's gone. See? Well, did you know that? Did you spot? Yes. You're like, yes. Do you, I've told you, well, my you attention to detail. Yeah. Oh, have you? Yeah. Do you go? Do you open? Know, can, can you see like the Big Bear and all that business? Yeah. There it is. Oh. There's Big Bear right there. What about the um? What's the other ones? The plow. 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 Big Bear. They're all on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's on there. Coming. I love that. <laughs> that <is> so good. <laughs> You're like geek alert. <laughs> <laughs> um. Do you know what? The other thing, just a little detail, but. The way, so that's the proper colour there, yeah. and it's just on the inside. Yeah. I just love that. Yeah. It's the kind of thing you get in cool adult clothes, but people don't always think about it with the with the little kids' clothes. So. Mums do. Mums do. Us mums yes, do. They do. Well, I think we might wrap it up there because. Oh, did you said you had some hard questions for me. No, I don't have any hard. Well, oh, well that's, that's really nice. Nice. I'm, I don't want to ask you hard questions. Okay. I want to, do you want to talk <laughs> about celebrity? Oh, you, you have to talk about you. anything you like. Yeah. You have whatever you want to ask me. I've been, I have been super interested in it because, like, yeah. obviously, I went in it. Um, I know you did. Well, I know I did. Yeah, I mean, my husband still talks about the bikini <laughs> shots quite a lot. I think most husbands <laughs> probably did. It's a changing moment for the show, wasn't it? I think. But it, it, at the time, obviously, it didn't feel like because I didn't have a clue. Yeah. You and could just and there, was was and and did I know. Of course, I didn't know. But now I do. Yeah, I very much. You know did now. really well. You came second. You did. Yeah, I did. I did. Came across really nice. I really enjoyed it. It was like it was like being at like some kind of scout camp or something. Yes. It was unbelievable. But <laughs> Were you like looking at the stars? What? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> no, it was. Oh, you're impressing everyone with your knowledge. And no, I'll tell you what I did do when I was in there that was really handy, which ties in beautifully with like the science of, of, of the stars and everything. Is I could make a sundial. Because oh. I didn't. Well, the worst thing, as you know, as a mum, is yeah. your, everything is to a schedule, isn't yes. it? Everything is about yeah, breakfast, lunch, know. dinner, yes. bedtime, bath. Yes. And then you get there and you just don't know what time it is. Oh, it's really you don't disconcerting. Have watching. You don't have no. watching. Oh, you don't have anything like that. Oh, that would drive so, what I used to do is I used to wake up at end of deck to say, I'm trying to get me out of here. We'd hear them on the bridge and then I would know the corresponding time back at home would be like about nine o'clock. Oh. And so we'd work backwards from there. Yeah, oh. no, it, things like that that you don't even. You'd be good to be on like um, a desert island with, I think. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I get on a desert island with. <laughs> could I say I take you? You could bring me. It'd be fun. I don't know if I'd be. I might not be so great at the cooking, but. Oh, I could be good. I could make. I'll do. The, I'll do the cocktails with the coconuts. Do you know what? Do you know what? I'm just thinking celebrity. I think Carol Waterman's been on. And I, yeah, I met you a couple of years ago, and just correct my memory, you showed me a picture of oh you. My God, do you remember that? Yes, you won. So Miley. We've got, I think she's a bit clever. I'm not going to say geeky, but you're pretty. I don't oh, know. Really you geeky. won a school prize. <laughs> so how did you manage this? I don't even know who celebrities, to be fair, Molly. Oh, wow. I mean, that's Tom Fletcher a few years ago, and that's been about it. Um, <laughs> you did, <don't, laughs> you did oh, like, sorry, you played some. Does he know anything about a back neck label? No, I have no interest in that. I challenge you that, Leonardo DiCaprio. Um, you, you won a school prize. Yeah, I did. Carol Waterman. But what was it? Was it a wheel thing? I can't remember what it was. You are freaking me out. Weird, I just think you were still Okay, so what I was, I must have been about 10 years old. I won a competition, which was like some kind of, it was like 
because I've done something it wasn't yes, yeah. Yeah. Can you show me the picture? And you had to make something that had a mechanism to it but was completely out of paper. And so I made a Ferris wheel with yeah. cobs. I can, I and then it was a weirdy thing, yeah. And I remember going the... to London to meet Carol Horton. Oh, you went to London because I thought she was at your school. I was you actually went. Time. I travelled to London oh. with my science teacher to meet Carol Horton. See, I do. I have the photo. I know, I've seen the photo because I remember this having this conversation. I was thinking, what? And you're also very good at um, Easter bonnets, aren't you? You're very creative. I like the creative side yeah. of things. So if there's anything from a creative point of view that I can get my, my teeth into, yeah. like the girls know I've got a blue garden, we just throw daffodils and all sorts onto those kind yeah. of things and, but then yeah there's there's other things i find more challenging so if there's like the bring and bake sale oh yeah the cooking food i've never made like, like in my life biscuits what do you do do you make it do you have a go and make make the cakes for the big part i could well what i'll say to the girls if we're baking today and we'll do sort of chocolate rice crispy cakes <laughs> so no, I mean, which I apparently is a baking Listen to this, my, this, I'm going to finish soon, but I just want to bring up a story from early today. Tell me what you think of this. Go on. There's a school up in Nottinghamshire, I think it is, and they're grading the parents, oh A to D, yeah. on their, like, how they do with the school and what events they attend and things like bringing cakes to the, to the sales and all these kind of things. Right. And they're marking the parents, A, B, C or D. Right. Do you have any thoughts on that? I mean, I'm, I'm really good at getting myself in trouble with things like this, aren't I? So, oh. um, my thoughts on this. What uh, do you think you'd get? I think in school, do you think you'd get? I would just say, so that actually, these, I'm terrible. Is there do enough anything pressure right. on us, Mark? I totally this. agree. Yeah. Do you know what a miracle it is that my kids have matching socks and their school Oh, my kids don't have matching socks. And the Christmas, <laughs> the Christmas jumper on today. Yeah. And I just, do you know what? I think a general rule would just be, can't we all just be a little bit kinder to each other, a bit nicer? Just remember that actually it's. You know, you, 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 all you want is for your children to be happy. Yeah. That's all you really, really want when you break it down. You take it down to like the bare bones of it. You just want your kids to be happy. Yeah. And like, we did our tests. Yeah, We've I done know. our tests. I know, and also, what we and there's, enough, the teachers. there's enough tests for the kids as it is already. And I just think ultimately, if my kids are happy, I am happy. Yeah. And if that means I get a D, E, F grade I because I didn't bake something, I, I, will, bake. I will own that. I know. I will own that F grade. Like, I'd probably give me an F grade for baking. I'm Maybe not so high even. <laughs> I'm the mum who takes my daughter perfect in her uniform and it's like own place day. And she's the only one. And then oh, I do that. So I would give so all you done it. We've all all done, done it. it, of course. So there we go. Miley, she's a, she well, doesn't care about the grade. She's an F in baking. <laughs> don't, don't have any more cooking. Do you know what? I don't care about those kind of grades as well because I think. I also remember the kids at school that were, were, you know, forced to get certain grades, and actually that you examine one element of your life, but you don't necessarily know how to, you know, speak to people, yeah. or just have a general idea of, of life. And there's just more. There is more to it than grades, and grades are great, and they show that they're indicative of so much. And I do believe in them in the right place. Yeah. But at the same time, I think you know, there's a lot to be said for having a bit of common common sense. Yeah. Knowing how to yeah. change a tire, knowing yeah. how to change a light bulb. Yeah. Just knowing where the fuse box is, that, yeah. that you know, just things that, that you're going to need every yeah, single day. day. No, I agree. And if you know you have a mum who's an amazing baker, then it's easy for her to get an A grade. And that's why we're not very good. And you might be delighted just to get a C on our baking because we're so rubbish. Do you know what? I don't, think gravy, I don't even like cooking, so that's gravy, what you cool. like, it will, not, it will not touch me. You like designing clothes? I love designing clothes. I love, designing clothes. <laughs> I love seeing, I, you know, I was shooting this collection yesterday and it was so lovely just to see the children running around in it and seeing what they were doing it and one of the t-shirts that has epic written on it. Oh yeah! This little boy was running around going, I'm epic! <laughs> I was like, perfect! Yes you are. Yes oh, you are. And that, this is what I do. So, oh, I get, you know, I think ultimately, just the best of the future. Yeah, that would be nice. Here, here, I think we're going to leave it there guys, because that is brilliant. And Miley, thank you so thank much. You. Thank you, thanks for amazing Thank you for, for lovely my cane. I wouldn't still be here 10 years down the line yes. if it wasn't for you guys. So oh. thank you for, for dressing your babies and your big babies now. Oh, exactly. There's going to be eight yeah. and 10 year olds in it, so thank you. Oh. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, bye guys.